away we are going live, live, live in the BF2 finals as I uh, have to uh, do this fantastic. I really don't want to be on that. I want to be on the USMC side. It is the attacking side I want to be starting on as I uh, have to bear with me. It's the good old BF2. You have to suicide and get straight in there to get the uh, free cam video, which we get straight away as we go right into it live as I... Uh, Pan straight up and see it is going to be AWOL versus Whoop. And now a quick look at the sides Norbert Colin, Robo, uh, Scummy, the Tanner, Proto for uh, Whoop. Whoop coming into this, and the vast underdogs AWOL coming through through the winner's bracket. It is Sheridan, Wild Ross, Gambit, Assassin, and Curb Dog. And uh, one of those guys in there it is Shredem, 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 Sheridan, Shredem. His name is Jack Bauer. With Jack Bauer on the side, they're not going to lose this game, but let's anyway. Pan up the road, Factor Phelps, if I go up the right right road to start with. It was the right road. I was right. So let's go straight up the pan. There we go. Immediately flying up there. You have to bear with me because this is the first time we've used free cam for a long, long time in Battlefield. As uh, Wu, basically, they are the US team. They are going to be the attacking team as they're trying to make a move in towards, well, it's Hotel Flag that they want to get in there. Well, it's going to be interesting to see. This is infantry, so it's in a 5 5 infantry cup, so obviously no vehicles going to be used. The Hotel Flag is the main going to be target. So we can see Norbert Collins just up the road there, looking to like he's going to try and. Head straight up the road. You can see he's got uh, AWOL just around the corner. He managed to take down Curb Dog. Curb Dog has been dropped, so Nerb Colin is uh, going to throw the grenades out. And they're going to make sure nobody comes in to revive him as we look down towards the back road. I'm guessing we're going to see some squad leader movements as we look across the right hand side. As you can see, well, I can see him on the map. I can't see where he is. He's making a mad dash, I would guess. Let's have a quick flag pass, flick pass there. It is going to be the market. The market is the main one that they want to get. That if they can capture that at the beginning, well, it would be game over. Good game, have fun. But unfortunately, they're stuck at the hotel. And bearing in mind, obviously, none of this jeep business. You can't fly past straight towards the hotel. We can look towards the hotel flag right now. Robo trying to make it move on towards the hotel flag. And Norbert Colin also coming around the corner. Robo got shot down there by Sheridan. Actually, it was Wild Ross that lied. But uh, A1, well, I've got to say, they are coming into this the massive, massive favourites. They've uh, not dropped a single ticket coming into this final. And, uh, <laughs> you, you know, you just can't say. When when you don't lose even a single ticket coming into a finals, you know you're going to be the number one players in this. But uh, I'm looking towards... The AWOL team, which is the uh, the MEC, and well, they have a pretty strong defence, and, and you have to say, Woot really wanted to get in there. Uh, Woot, Woot, Woop. <laughs> oh, these damn team names, I tell you. It is Woop, sorry. And, uh, well, you know, they wanted to get in that hotel flag to start with at the beginning, but it's just not happening at the moment. They've been pinned back, and it's best not be the start and the beginning of the end for Woop. But they say you need to, uh, they need to start using the squad system a little bit stronger and uh, try and get a a squad member. You can see on the left-hand side it is uh, the talent that's in there with the squad. Uh, I guess he is the main commander as well, and he's uh, well, he actually took his time to take down Gambit there, but he does take down Gambit. He's going to come round, and he immediately gets taken straight out there. Assassin coming round as well, and well, you can see at the moment AWOL with their impenetrable defensive line, because uh, we really just... If we have a look around, not a single player getting in towards it. There's a massive radar going down and you can just see AWOL basically they have that defensive line set up on the radar in the top right hand corner and you can just see that no players of Woob are actually getting through to it. Every time they get to that hill you see Norbert Collin trying to revive his teammate and gets taken down in the meantime by Curb Dog. Curb Dog at the moment. Let's have a look at all towards the Frank straight away. You can see well eight kills one death. That's just them. Um, that's clocking them up so uh, let's have a look on towards the left hand side at the moment. We can see that uh, See, they're trying to make a move around this left-hand side. But, well, AWOL once again, you can see them in the foreground. Two players there cutting them down. So as soon as we try to make the way around with a couple of uh, squad commanders, just doesn't happen. Shut down. So back to the beginning. Let's have a look. So you can see Robo, Robo making a move. Or Robo? Robo? Robo. I'm not too sure in his exact name, but we can see him down in the bottom corner here. Throwing the grenades out at the moment. Oh, he gets picked straight off. And the MEC, well, you have to say, AWOL have an immense defensive line at the moment. 193 tickets to 155. They've lost, what, no, seven seven tickets in this? I believe they start with 200. I might be slightly wrong. Might be 210. Let's have a quick look at the frags. Uh, just around about 10, but uh, tell them uh, to get out of here if you don't mind while well, we are on air, but uh, instead of arguing, uh, but anyway, <laughs> I'm sure you might be able to hear Jay and uh, 
Jay and Houdini in the background as uh, Jay, the uh, the man, the legend from the BF2, as he joins to watch. But at the moment, it is complete dominance from AWOL, as we did expect coming into this game. And it is whoop, whoop. Well, they just they're, they can't even run away and uh, without being shot in the back. And uh, well, you can just look at the radar. You can see just how much that uh, AWOL are actually pushing out. They're actually attacking whoop in their spawn points now. And uh, 193 to 141, it's not looking good for whoop and whoop. Well. They're actually in their own spawn area. This is this is just phenomenal play from AWOL. They've forced them back so much that the fact that they've not even been able to push. And uh, Woob are actually having to crouch and lie and go prone in their own defensive line. But uh, so we pan up towards AWOL. You can see well, AWOL is even using pistols now. This is just this is just a uh, I, I would say a word, but I'm not allowed to say it. A uh, a uh, a Mickey take. A Mickey take, yes. Um, it begins with P and ends with S, I believe, is the word I was after. But it is, uh, they are really in a dominant position. And uh, i got to say, Woob just not, not using the squad system to how it should be used. They need the squad leaders to hang back and then spawn in massively off that one squad leader. Instead, they prefer to try to use two. And it's just not working because... Let's have a look across, actually. As I do mention that, I can see one one he's managing to get around there. It is the tournament of Norbert Colin. We saw them actually up in the... Uh, far back and if they can make their way around to the market then you know they might get a chance if they can get around the back area so it's, it's a still a long 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 way to go and it's uh, it is the market flag they're going to run for obviously we've got the one in the open but this is a long long walk but they are getting there they're halfway there and can see the town are making his move let's have a look around see if we can see any AWOL actually around this area defensively I'm guessing not a lot they can suicide back and uh, spawn in there we are using free camera obviously it's uh, used to use the uh, first person view but uh you know, it's just it just seems so much easier using free cam in this game. But anyway, looking towards Woob at the moment, Woob trying to push on that corner, and that just shows how much AWOL are attacking. They're actually up on the hill on the left hand side, taking down <laughs> coming there, Robo and Proto coming round. But uh, well, you have to say AWOL are completely dominating at the moment, and the assassin, the commander, is even on the run now. So the commander even out there doing all the all he can, but Robo at the moment trying to. Uh, Token down, he gets picked off once again by Curb Dog. Curb Dog actually kills Gambit in the back there, takes him down, takes down his own teammate. But they are on the hills, you can see the grenades coming down. But, uh, well, let's have a look back towards the man at the back because I'm going to have to fly back there. He is back here somewhere, it is. <coughs> the Tanner and Norbert Collin, Norbert Collin at the moment, you can see AWOL have managed to spawn back there. In fact, the Tanner and Norbert Collin are oh, both taken down by the one and only Jack Bauer. Do not mess with the team that has Jack Bauer in it because they will shut you down. There was no mention of 24 minutes, but uh, they just shut it down. <laughs> anyway, 24 hours, sorry to say. 12 minutes, 22 to go in this game. 107 on the board for Woob and, uh, well, 188 for AWOL. And still no bleed onto, uh, no way, not even a bleed, not even stop the bleed yet onto AWOL. AWOL at the moment just getting in basically all the frags. Let's have a quick look at the frags as we mentioned it. You can see 12 kills, one death to Wild Ross, Gambit with 9 and 2. Curb Dog with uh, 12 and 4. Assassin actually only on 5 and 3, but he's the commander, I believe, in Sheridan. Just going at the back there with 8 and 3. And, well, the highest fragger on uh, Woob at the moment, 11 kills. And, uh, well, 